Yo, you want to talk Yeezys? Well, we could talk Yeezys, but just know that the game has changed and you have less than two weeks to get it together. No joke. Let's start the show. <laughs> Welcome to the Heat Check. I am your host, Jacques Slade, and you already know I've got you covered with what to cop this week. We're going to kick things off with all the ladies in the place with style and grace. This finish line is hooking you up with three different Puma shoes. First up is the Lead Cat Slide, brought to you courtesy of Rihanna's collaboration with the brand. You get a burnt olive colorway dropping on Thursday, and those will cost you $90. Now, one of the more interesting looks from the brand is the Muse Echo. Puma has these dropping in three different colorways. There's a white pair, a black pair, and this colorway, which they're calling Rock Ridge. Definitely one of the more unique silhouettes from the brand, and those will cost you $130. But it does not stop there. Puma also has the Phenom Suede dropping in three different colorways as well. Puma's in a very good place right now when it comes to women's footwear and women's sneaker game. Look for those to cost you $100 when they drop over at Finish Line. <laughs> All right, switching sides for a brief second. Jordan Brand is coming through this week with a premium version of the Air Jordan 5. Jordan has been doing some really cool things when it comes to their premium offerings, and this pair mirrors an olive pair that dropped earlier in the year. If you like your premium kicks in Bordeaux, then these will cost you $400. All right, getting back to the ladies, a very special Nike Air Foam Posit 1 is dropping for you. The internet is calling these shine, and it makes sense since the way that the upper pops on these. Look for those to cost you $230. Now, sticking with the Nike sportswear vibe, the Nike Air Vapor Max LTR suede will be dropping later this week as well. This one looks like a lot like a winter shoe, but that's just me. All right, switching out to Germany, we get some love from the three stripes with the Adidas Pro Fear. This is a brand new silhouette from the brand, and they're launching it in both the men's and women's colorway of black, white, and solar red. Chunky midsoles, they're definitely a thing right now, and Adidas is riding that wave pretty well with this model. Look for those to drop over at finish line, and they'll cost you $120. If you feel the need to have your sneakers get a little more love on the court than your actual game, well, Nike is dropping a Volt colorway of Paul George's signature sneaker, the Nike PG-1. Now, the majority of this upper is Volt, giving the shoe the title of one of the brightest we've seen, if not the brightest I've seen so far from Paul. Those will cost you $110. I really do hope your game matches up to the brightness of those shoes. Next up, we're going to go old school like Big Daddy Kane with the new release of the Nike Air Max 1. The model is a throwback to one of the OG colorways of the shoe, and you can grab this pair starting on Thursday for $140. Reebok stepped out of the basketball world a little while ago, but they do still have some retro models dropping. Today, we get a look at the Kamikaze 2 in a special colorway called ATL to LAX, and they basically drop in a black and white colorway. Those will cost you $150 for that old school vibe. All right, the Special Forces version of the Air Force One is dropping this week, and it looks great in this burgundy colorway. Of all of the crazy ways they are designing Air Force Ones these days, this style is the coolest to me. You can either grab this deep burgundy for the men or this red, AKA cedar for the women. Both pair will cost you $180. <laughs> Jumping ahead to Saturday, Jordan Brand continues to bring the Be Like Mike collaboration with Gatorade to the table. This weekend, there are two shoes releasing to help tell that story. First up is the Air Jordan 6. The model rocks a mostly white upper with orange on the inlays, and there are also a few Gatorade-inspired details hiding in there as well. Those will cost you $190 over at Finish Line. And if you're looking for something a bit more performance-oriented in mind, the Air Jordan 32 is releasing as well. Like the Air Jordan 6, this model has some inspiration from Gatorade, and that includes details on the upper. The Jordan 32 is just a great basketball shoe to play in, and this collaboration looks really great on that upper. Look for those to cost you $160. Now, more is more when it comes to Steph Curry and his sneaker line. So this week, Under Armour is dropping the More Dimes colorway. Color-wise, the Curry keeps it pretty simple with a mostly black upper, though with a name like More Dimes, you hope that this pair will help improve your game just a little bit. Look for those to cost you $130 when they drop on Saturday at finish line. And last but not least, we have the shoe that you all came here for, the Adidas Yeezy 352 in the blue tint colorway. I'm just saying this as a PSA now, but the shoes are limited and you will be definitely lucky if you grab a pair. Finish Line is going to have pairs of the shoe both online and at select locations where you can enter a raffle to cop a pair. While I've been told that the numbers on this colorway will not be super limited, it is still going to be limited. So it's limited, but not super limited. Either way, look for these to cost you $220 both in-store and online over at Finish Line. All right, guys, as with every week, I just wanted to talk to you about the stuff that I knew you would definitely be checking out. Make sure you check down below for links to all the shoes that I talked about in this video. I am Jacques Slade. This is the Heat Check presented by Finish Line, live from the new store in Delamo. As always, guys, I appreciate you, and I'll see you next week. Peace.